Hey everybody, the Reeswirl here, and welcome back to The Witcher. Holy balls, today has been stressful trying to get this bloody thing working. The game's fine, but I tried recording this like four hours ago. Actually, no, I didn't even try recording it. I started the game up. I had to make my way through the werewolf lair and the sewers again for some reason, because I don't think I saved, which is dumb. But when I did that, I noticed that the game was running like awfully. It was running really badly. Like, literally, how much, like, how are my frames now? Like, I'm running at 60, which is about you, like, that's normal. But, earlier, <laughs> I was not running at 60, I was running at about 13. Something had happened, I don't know whether it was to do with Windows Update, or whether it was to, to do with a, just a GPU update, but, I didn't have, I, you know, the Windows updates or the GPU update, so it was one or the other. And, you know, not having those updates caused the game to run like absolute shit. Not just this game, it caused any game I try to run, um, to run like garbage. So I'm very happy to know that that is fixed now. Right, what have we done? I need to go to the new narrow cart. I don't know what for. What do I need to go there for? Lock and key. Oh, uh, Levada need to see the magic stone. That's right. I need to talk to Carmen about Vincent, which I'm going to go. Ah, oh, crap. I'm going to go do. Nope. The guard should be able to take care of that. Unless the thing is literally running after me. No, I didn't. Good. Bye. But it was weird because I was... One thing I have noticed with this game though is that the load times are not incredible anymore. It loads pretty quick, but for the most part it's still a good like five or so seconds. Which is fine. It's just, um... I think they were better to begin with. Like at the start of the game, maybe that has something to do with it, because they were smaller areas. I, don't, I really have no idea. But either way, I just got really worried, because I was like, uh-oh. I hope it's to do with an update. Well, actually what I did was, I thought it was just due to the G down to the GPU, so I just uh, updated my NVIDIA. And um, <clears throat> I updated it, then I had to wait for all my stuff to upload, and then restarted. But when I restarted, that's when I noticed I had a bunch of Windows updates. So I was like, hmm, it was probably a Windows update. But I'm also <laughs> thinking whether it was down to having the uh, videos uploading while trying to play, but then I'm pretty sure I've done that in the past, so I doubt it was anything to do with that. Wait, new talents? Oh, really? Did I level up again? Yeah, I must have. So I have another silver. Shoot. Intelligence? Sign intensity. I'm not bothered about that though. I don't use the signs. At all. Can I do that? Oh, I can get group silver. That works. They require mutagens. Oh no, they don't. Only works if the opponent is under the effect of incineration, which they aren't. Get that. There we go. Precise hit. 10%. Alright. We're good. Meditate for... well, go till morning. There we go. Till 9am. That'll be good enough, I think. Then we can uh, continue with the other quests. Mm-hmm. Hmm. I just realised as well, Ram's meat's completely disappeared from the face of the earth. He was in chapter 2, but now he's like, completely buggered off. So, did somebody kill him? Right, Carmen. I need to speak to you about your man. <laughs> Greetings. You've returned safely. The Hierophant revealed the cure for lycanthropy, but I must know your beloved's name. I'll not betray my man's identity. I'd rather he stay a werewolf. Carmen, I already know that Vincent's the werewolf. Please don't hurt him. I'll try to help him. Listen carefully. Yes? Uh... What's your... Wait, really? I spoke to the Hierophant about your man's... affliction. Oh. Overnight, Vincent should wear a shirt woven from fool's parsley, and the spell will be lifted. That's what I'll do. Uh... Okay. I brought the parsley leaves. Weave a shirt for Vincent to lift the spell. Thank you. I'll start immediately. 
Can I speak with you again? I need to get the leaves to come and need to discuss the details. Only my man is important now. Sometime. Ah, oh, damn it. To see if it worked. That's a pin. I, can't, I, can't I don't have any flint. Damn it. Seems I, have to light it first. I don't know how if I should rest for over a day, over a day, or if I should just rest for like an hour. An hour might work, but a day might also work. Damn. God, you are Can gross. Five, five orange. All right. <clears throat> I'll go for an hour. Actually, no. We'll actually just go straight till dawn. Perfect. Alrighty. I just want to finish Beauty and the Beast because I think it's the only, like one of the only side quests I have left, and it's one I'm actually interested in because we get to see a goddamn werewolf. Yeah, and the other, only other thing is won't hurt a bit, which I honestly cannot be bothered to do. That means I have to go out my way to find different teeth. Carmen. Yes. Did the shirt cure Vincent? It was terrifying. The moon appeared. Vincent transformed. Shredded the shirt and ran off. Calm down, Carmen. Maybe another method will be more effective. Yes? Mm -hmm. Yes. What's your real name? Hella, but that's too common. Ah. Farewell. So, try all the remedies for ly lycanthropy. They mentioned a potion. Maybe Kopstein will have the answer. That I so desire. Maybe. I mean, it's worth trying. And I'm pretty sure there was only two remedies. One was the shirt, and the other was... Oh, no, 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 no. That's not true. There were three remedies. Shirt, potion, and love. Which is just... The last one's really corny, and I highly doubt that would be effective. But, guess we'll find out. Right to teleport uh, to the swamp. And away we go. Yes? Can you make a potion to cure lycanthropy? Hmm, never tried. The potion's for a werewolf, the beloved of a young woman. Usually I'd refuse, but I owe you. Let's see. Ingredients, check. Equipment, check. Come back later, okay? Okay. Alchemist promised to make medicine for this and I should tend to other matters. Be better. Come back later. <laughs> Come back later. Alright. God damn it, there's so much waiting around that I need to do. Uh Coxstein. Okay. Yeah. Do 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 So now we're back here. The worst part is I can't rest anymore. Like, within Cogsteins I can't rest, because I can't initiate it. Kind of sucks. Um however, v Vivaldi lives next door. That'll work. Hooray! Hooray! So just a sec. Alright, Golan. Golan. What brings you here? Oh, I can't rest here either. Goodbye. Oh, blows. Why can't I rest here? That sucks. I thought I could. It really does suck. I can't rest at anybody's house in Chapter 2. I can't go to Shani's. She'll just kick me out. Look at him run. Damn, I need to... Damn it. I wonder if I could just go straight, like, go back. Did that work? It probably won't, but we might, it might, it might. I hope it will. Because I'd rather not have to go out of my way to rest. And stuff. Because I think lock and key might actually start the end of the chapter, which is not what I want. No. I want to finish this before the end of the chapter. Yeah. That does work. Did you finish the lycanthropy potion? Yes, but... She will administer it at her own risk once it drops in one of her tears. The potion needs a virgin's tear to work. Wait, you said nothing about a virgin. 
You said a young maiden. I assumed she wasn't yet married. Ah, uh, Kaltstein. You need to get out more. Where will I find a virgin? A virgin's tear is vital. It can't be difficult to find one. I need a virgin's tear. I should have some townswomen. Why not the nuns? Or nurses at St. Lebiotis? Hmm. I think that would be fine. I, they just look like nuns, so that's what I'm assuming. What's happening? Oh. I'll stay here, thanks. Right, virgin steer. God damn. Some complex uh, ingredients are required, it would seem. Okay. Mm Saint Leviota. I was about to say, where is it? It's right in front of me. Do 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 do. I never noticed that before. Uh, like a bell. Just never seen it. But to be fair, we've done quite a lot of stuff in chapter three, so should be all right. Can I just speak with one of the nurses? Hello. May I help? Forgive me. I need a virgin's tear to cure a man's curse. A surprising proposition. I thought you could help. Helping others is my calling. And you found... the right person. I'll shed a tear for you. Thanks. Thanks. We did it! Die. Take the potion to Carmen. Oh, nice. That worked. They just... I don't know why I thought they were nuns. They're nurses. But I guess that worked. Is a pretty unusual one. So I need a tear of a virgin. <laughs> It'd be quite funny if she was like, So why did you come to me? Uh, that would just be an awkward, uh, what is it? An awkward conversation. Sorry. Amen. Yes? Here's a magic potion against lycanthropy. It should help. How will I repay you? Don't tell anyone I did this for free. I have my reputation. I'll give this potion to Vincent. Only my man is important now. Wait, can I just do this? Go into the... Oh, Eager Thighs is what this place is called. Very interesting. I'm just curious if I can just go into a building and then out. I think that works. Yes? That is brilliant. I really wish I knew did that. The potion work? Oh, Master Witcher. I made certain Vincent drank it, but nothing happened. But we'll find another way. Yes? Yes? I've heard stories of true love changing beasts into men. But we make love regularly. Love means more than frolicking in bed. Yeah. I know Vincent doesn't love me. Sometimes when he's angry, he calls me a vile whore. Carmen. I know I turned tricks. But for him, I'd agreed to be like other girls. Damn it. I'd even learned how to embroider. Whoa. Uh, yeah, which one do I say? Witches aren't exactly good. Oh, God. It's clear his lycanthropy isn't... Tell him you love him and how you try to keep... Nah, because he'll probably be... Well, witches are hardly experts on matters of love. Yes? Ah, oh, I do need to do that then. Listen, I guess. It's clear Vincent's lycanthropy isn't your biggest problem. Tell him you love him and how you tried to cure him. If he's not a complete swine, he'll react. He's unsure. Torn between me and his work. He needs to set his priorities straight. Witcher, please talk to him. He's at the station. Yeah, where he always is. A real downpour. I need to be certain. I must try the last method. True love. Claims Vincent doesn't love her, she talk to the captain. Oh my god. Just back and forth talking with this. What is that icon? Oh, it's system. Oh, right. <laughs> I didn't even think. Is that inventory? I think the blue thing. Journal. Oh, it actually flashes blue when there's new in entries, I think. That's pretty cool. Vincent! Uh. Okay, I was about to say he isn't here. He disappeared. Greetings. What's up? 
Carmen asked me to see you. Witcher detective turns Witcher therapist. In brief, Carmen doesn't like you being a werewolf. What's your beef? It's not my choice. I can lift the curse, but you must desire it. You want to be with Carmen? Witcher... Will you give up your superhuman strength for love? Strength I use against evil. Strength that will one day consume you. You still have a choice. I'll think about it, Witcher. Love can move mountains, but... It must be true. Okay, well we spoke with him. Visit Carmen in some time and ask her if anything changed. So basically, go and see Carmen if she doesn't have an answer. Go inside the house next to her, or into the brothel. And then back out, talk to her again, and see what happened. It's perfect. And it should work. As in doing that, I hope. We'll find out, either way. Goddamn. Oh my god, I got down the bloody stairs. What's the timer? Whoop. It's 9.30. It's not even late. Only my man is important okay, now. I need to do this. Okay. Perfect. Oh. Yes? I saw Vincent. Oh, Witcher. I don't know how to thank you. I'm awash in happiness. We had an honest conversation. I told him everything. How much I love him. Finally. He said if I cared so much, maybe this love deserves a chance. First time I ever saw him cry. Sometimes the simplest solutions are best. But that's not all. I haven't found hair in our bed recently. Maybe... Never mind, I don't want to jinx it. I have to believe that everything will be all right. That's good to hear. True love can work wonders. Done. We did it. Hey! He was freed from the lycanthropy curse. Nice. So if it's called lycanthropy... What, is it just a lycanthrope? Or... Lycanthrop? I, I don't know what you'd call a singular and not the curse itself. I've always called them lycanthorps. Oh, you know, just werewolves. <laughs> just calling them werewolves is a bit easier. But yeah, I don't really know. By the way. Now I can do lock and key, so I need to go and see... Levarden at the uh, new narrow cart. Just be like, yo dude, I got this magical stone thing that was used to talk with someone in Redania. It was someone from Redania, wasn't it? It was the king, not the prince. I don't remember. It was one or the other. My shoulder hurts. Oh, Wait, do I go? Oh yeah, new narrow cart. Why is the thing pointing me in a different direction? Oh, because none of them are selected. There we go. The new narrow cart. Which I believe is straight down here. A witcher, hide your women. Witcher women. It is down. Oh no, it's down here and to the right, that's right. I always forget. There it is. Make a beeline for it. Ah. Knights should fight monsters. Not witchers. Oh, shut up. Shut your damn face. We made it! Yeah, the new narrow cart. And Luvadan should be upstairs. Maybe Triss as well. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, I just heard someone get smacked. Whoopsh. That was more like a whip sound, but whatever. Alright, Luvadan should just be over here. Declan! Oh god, he ain't here. Huh. He is here, though. Oh, he's over there, that's why. Shoot. My bad. Yes? Yes? I found a magical stone at the Salamander hideout. Show it to Triss. She knows about such things. I thought. I know nothing about magic. God fucking damn it. Of course. Why did I even take it to Lovarden? I should have just taken it to Triss. That makes way more sense. Ask Triss about the magic stone. I like how it still points me to the new narrow car though. 
Even though that's not where I need to be at all, and where I need to be is Trish's house, which is directly ahead. Look at all those unknown herbs. Ah, uh, well, never mind. There we go. Right, is Trish upstairs or down? She is probably getting ready. Come to think of it, she is never ready before like midday. There she is. Do it. What up? Geralt. So, uh. Listen about my identity. Can I solve this? Progress already. Oh, I don't. I don't want to help them though. I'm still analyzing. Geralt. Listen, I found a magical stone at the Salamandra hideout. Interesting. Let me see. Geralt, it's a telecommunicator. It leaves a magical trace of any transfers. Meaning? With a bit of luck, we can use this to find the Salamandra base. So? We'll talk to Luvarden about it. Oh. Go to Banquet and speak with Triss or Luvarden. God fucking damn it. Now I need to go back to theirs. About what? What was that saying? Oh wait, I should ask Triss about tracing Radovid using the magic stone we need to speak in private. Okay Triss, Radovid. Girl. Yeah, it's nothing about that. Know anything more about that magic communicator I gave you? It allows conversations over short distances. With some knowledge of magic, one can draw quite a bit of information from it. If the salamanders were using it to communicate with their base, I should be able to pinpoint its location. Short distances. Interesting. Can you check the last communication? The communicator sent a signal to a house in Vizima. It's marked on your map. Is there something I should know? I have a hunch. I'll check it out. Alright, but be careful. Okay. Thank you. I'll see yeah, you I, I don't want to speak about my identity, because I have not agreed to help the Order of the Flaming Rose. And to be fair, I would rather not help the Order of the Flaming Rose. Oh god. So... Now I need to head all the way back down here. And back to the new Narragart. I think we'll get to chapter 4 though. To be honest, I'd, I'd say this game's wrapping up. Yeah. I mean, there's chapter 4 and then there's the epilogue. But chapter 4 still has a fair amount of stuff to it. It's got about, like, 15 or so quests. Maybe only, like, 13. But that includes side and main, so... It's probably the one of the shorter ones. As for the epilogue, I think epilogue is just quests. Like, main quests, I mean. Declan is in here now. There he is. He's always moving. We have news about Salamander. Sweet. Good news, I hope. Alas, no. Its influence reaches further than we anticipated. And oh. you have an offer for me. Why the sarcasm? Salamander has strong political backing. We've been unable to convince town or military authorities to take them on. How is that possible? I suspect it relates to recent suspicious edicts. Mm. What will you do? We need support. An army unit or similar force. How does that involve me? We'd like you to negotiate with our potential allies. Who mm. do you have in mind? Probably. Salamander have ruffled some feathers. I knew it. The Skleta. The Order of the Flaming Rose. Oh, does that mean I have to take a side? I don't want to. I mean, it did say Siegfried owes me. It did say he owes me, so would this count as a favor, or would it count as us literally working together? Because I don't want to work together. I want to stay on my own, but <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I hate this. Yeah, I do indeed. God damn it. Oh, man. I'll just say... Sure. I'll see what I can do. If you succeed, we will meet them here. I need to speak with Levarden. Yes. 
Oh. May I ask something? Of course. I see many expect. Ha! If you. I'm a. Okay, we've already Fair been through that. Time to confront the guilty. I don't really understand. Must convince Eva Yevin and the elves of Siegfried and his friends from the Order to join us. Ugh. Does that mean I'm working with them? I guess. I have to. I don't get a choice, which bloody sucks. Oh man. Yeah. Right, where is it? I need to go to find Siegfried. Oh. I have no idea. I'm assuming I can just go to the temple quarter and up to the Order hideout. Could I not just be a friend of the Order? Like, I'd rather just be a friend of the Order instead of actually being part of them. I don't think I'm part of them, though. Because I think when you become part of the Order, they actually give you something. It's like a medallion. It, it's something to that effect. Yeah. Either way. Oh god. Come on. So I think the Unforgiven might be the last quest for the chapter. Maybe. Yeah. Oh, I wondered what that noise was. It sounded like there was something getting jotted down in a journal. Hmm. But this is where Siegfried should be. And Siegfried's the only one I can actually speak with. But what happens happens, I suppose. I would like to remain neutral. If that is not a possibility, then what can I do? What happens if I speak with this guy though? Need it? Will you sell me your wares? Siegfried's friends are always welcome. If you Oh my god, I can actually I can buy shit from you, but I'm a friend of the Order. He did make sure to say that. What's this? That's the city guard. Well, he can he will buy anything. And everything. That is amazing! Wait, I thought Flutterfangs were, like, expensive, but clearly not. I've read that, you can have that, and that, and that. Oh my god, this is amazing! I can sell absolutely everything to him. These weak? Yeah, they're weak. Wait. It's a potion base. Maybe it won't sell the potion base stuff. I just think that'd be a bad idea. Can I upgrade these? Oh. Eternal fire fill my heart. Oh my god, that was cool. Need any? I do. Will you sell Siegfried? Yep, Siegfried trends are always welcome. I know. Salt Pater. I thought I could use the arrows to increase the amount I want to sell. But I can't. It's an unknown potion. I would rather sell an unknown potion. Oh my god, it feels good being able to just sell all of these. Hey! Finally! Hey there. It's also a potion base. Whatever. God, there's so much booze. Like, Geralt has literally so much booze. I'm actually looking to getting new armor. If that is a possibility. It'd be nice. Oh, yay. That's a lot of money. Hmm. That actually was a lot of money. Which one? It was this one. Yeah, 400 each. It's just known as very old wine. Uh, that'll do. And I can sell all of these if I wanted as well. But I don't. So things are fine. Cool. Apprentice. Sir, can I have a look? Well, as you wish. <laughs> my face is a shield. Oh. Oh, hang on. Studded leather jacket. Excellent leather jacket. Oh, it's five grand. Sure. Ta-da! Which means damage received negative fifteen percent. Oh no, my my jacket. Yeah, this does. This looks a lot better. Well, it was worth the five grand then, in that case. Yep, Siegfried's over here. Perfect. 
Oh god. Sup. Geralt? How's your leg? Fine. A mere scratch. Everything alright? I'm to receive a medal for saving the property of some townspeople. I see. You'd be eligible, but medals are only awarded to knights. Unless... No. I won't join with that vow of celibacy. I understand. Hey, the Grand Master himself is going to present the medal to me. Yes? Uh, yeah. I have a proposal. Will you help me destroy the Salamandra? How? I have powerful friends who know how to destroy it. Is this some political plot? Siegfried, you trusted me at the bank. Okay. Any details? The new Naracourt Tavern. Come by tonight. I'll be there. Wait for our signal. Alright. Let's go. Hmm. Right, so now we can go back. I think I might just teleport to Triss. Triss is.